Under the original 83 Tejas Mark one a contract, Hindustan Aeronautics had to build 73 single-seater Mark 1A fighter jets and 10 trainers, but the Indian Air Force and Hindustan Aeronautics are planning to make some changes in the plan, and now all the upcoming 83 aircraft will be single-seater Mark 1A fighter jets. Hindustan Aeronautics has delivered 16 IOC Mark I fighters, and will complete the delivery of 16 FOC Mark I fighters by 2021, and will then start manufacturing of 18 trainers, which will be followed by manufacturing of 83 single-seater Tejas Mark I-A fighter jets, taking the total fleet strength of the indigenous fighter jet to 133. French manufacturer Naval Group has offered to build six SMX 3.0 stealth submarines under the Project 75I of the Indian Navy, in which two local shipyards Larsen and Tubro and Mazagin dock shipbuilders have already been shortlisted. The SMX 3.0 has eight vertical launch systems, and apart from the Exocet anti-ship systems and scalp cruise systems, it can also be equipped with the next-generation Brahmos system and the new indigenous long-range cruise system. The 3000-ton SMX 3.0 is capable of launching unmanned underwater vehicle and unmanned aerial vehicle to gather intelligence, and it also has improved acoustic discretion due to its hydrodynamic shape and masking coating, and the adoption of the X rudder design from the Barracuda class results in increased maneuverability. The air independent propulsion system includes second generation fuel cells for underwater endurance of 21 days, with a maximum range of 12,800 km at a speed of 10 knots. The submarine also features better power management and system upgradability, which will result in better maintenance of the submarine. Boeing's program manager for the F-15 has said, that the F-15 EX fighter jet offered to India will be equipped with the Raytheon APG-82 radar, that has been derived from the APG-81 radar of the F-35. Experts have said, that Boeing is trying to position its F-15 EX as a platform that is cheaper than the French Rafale fighter jet to remain in the competition. Each Su-30 fighter jet built by Hindustan Aeronautics costs $70.3 million, and the Super Shukhoi upgrade will cost around $15 million per aircraft with new engines, and as the Indian Air Force is not keen on upgrading the majority of the Su-30 fighters, Boeing is positioning its F-15EX as a supplementary fighter jet that would cost the same as a Super Shukhoi, but will augment its air superiority capabilities with hypersonic systems, and a high operational availability of more than 75%. China has ramped up the work on its third and fourth aircraft carriers, and both are now in the final assembly process, and are expected to be combat ready by 2025. The third aircraft carrier would have a displacement of 85,000 tons, as compared to 45,000 ton INS Vikramaditya, and both these aircraft carriers are expected to use electromagnetic catapults, and could carry more than 50 fighter jets. Oh, my God.